Greetings YouTube, being a part of beta test is awesome for two reasons. One, you get to try out the new beta tested champs and it's been really fun to test out Colossus and New Balls Logan. But uh, the better thing I think is that if you're curious about champs that you could rank up but probably never will, you can test them without having to worry about losing those items. Remember these things? Rank down tickets? Oh, man, do I miss them. Well, you can buy them even for rank 5 to rank 4 5 stars. And remember what they used to look like? Just to remind those of you who maybe have never seen these before. They're pretty dang amazing. And I have, of course, some champions up to rank 5 that are mutants. And if you rank them down, you get all the items you rank them up with. And so with those items, you can take non-mutant champions up and I personally have the resources to try something different. Because on my channel, sometimes I like to be weird, right? I get comments all the time, Prof, your videos are too weird. They're not mainstream enough. There's not enough Alliance War, you know, fights or uh, Alliance quests. You know, there's, there's not enough gameplay. There's Well, my channel is just a weird one. What can I tell you? It's a mixed bag of different kind of videos that aren't for everybody. But hopefully there's something for you at some point. And is this video going to be it? Who knows? But we're going to go to my six-star collection because I am one of the few people who has a rank one awakened six-star Hulkbuster. And I have the materials in the beta to take him to rank two. So we are just going to see what this guy can do, the kind of damage that he can put forth. Fun fact, if you go all the way back to now over two years ago when I started my MCOC YouTube channel, you will see that the face of my profile when I joined YouTube was none other than Hulkbuster himself. He was the only four-star that I could consistently get duped in a four-star crystal. The RNG kept giving me Mr. Hulkbuster. So he was my best champion. He was my highest rated champion, and he was a champion that, uh, whether it be 440 or eventually 550, got me to win quite a few Alliance Quest matches, even when I first did Map 5. Now, you might be wondering, why? Hulkbuster sucks. Well, what I'm looking forward to testing out is the damage of his special three. I think Hulkbuster has a very underrated and underappreciated special three, and he's the kind of champion, if he had his own beta test, who would absolutely 100% have a use in this game. And uh, we are now going to see his PI is at 13,700, 36,000 health. If you're wondering how that compares to my other rank two six stars, let's sort them and go through. So Corvus has 30,000 health, Domino 31, Ghost 29, and Hulkbuster 34. So he's a tank for sure. And I do remember, of course, I didn't use uh, the standard mastery uh, setup that I do now, but I do remember quite a few times where I would use him to enjoy the, uh, the fruits of his getting hit in the face labor, shall we say. And let's, uh, let's go to Realm of Legends just to test this out, right? Let's go to Realm of Legends. We're just going to do the standard protocol. I have... It's been so long since I played with Hulkbuster that I don't even know really what his um, synergies are. Let's see. He's got a crit rating bonus with Ultron. And crit. Let's just we'll throw this in there. And then maybe we'll do some, some mutant, right? Maybe we'll do uh, hmm, some crit bonuses. Let's go to the mutants. We will go, who do we want to throw in here? A Colossus. And, um, hmm, <laughs> Magneto. Let's do double Colossus Magneto, just just for fun. Or actually, double, double Cyclops and Magneto? I don't know. We'll figure it out. There we go. <laughs> Why is Emma in this? I don't know. We'll keep her in there. And we are going to go against the man that needs for sure. A better healthcare plan. And that is none other than Realm of Legends. Winter Soldier. All I care about is seeing 
the crits and the damage of the special three. So we're just going to try to build up the special three. Now he's getting, wow, 4,000 crits on a medium. Okay. Show me the power of that special three. Since we don't have to worry in this of the special three triggering, I'll just block the special two. I'll face block it. Speaking of which, here we go. Charge up. You know, 4,000 with the medium could be worse. We'll dex this. Bada boom. Oh, we're going to have the first one. All right, let's get that damage right. Plus 12%. Okay. How much damage is that? 29,000 for a special three. That's not bad, right? I mean, don't sleep on rank two, six star Hulkbuster. Everybody is going to remember this when he gets buffed. And now I'm going to be able to really focus on taking him up. Will he ever be Ghost? Probably not. He's too fat. But at the same time, we'll see if we can beat it. We'll do one more special three. I don't think there's going to do the community any benefit to to knock out, you know, Winter Soldier. In fact, you know what would be, well, I was going to say I could do a special two, then a special three, but I don't think I'll have the, the ability to do that with power. All right, here we go. We have plus 12%. Let's see if we can beat 29,000. Survey says still 29. All right, three, third time's the charm, so we'll see. If they could apply some armor breaks to his regular hits, like, say, Iron Fist, and then you launch that special three, that would be insane. That would be OG pre-patch 12.0 Thor kind of damage, I would think. See, we could do a special two, and maybe we should just try that. You've got the triple armor break. I just wish they lasted longer. Like, what if the buff to this champion was just making his armor breaks on his special two last the duration of of the armor breaks of symbiote spidey's heavy attack and then you build up to the special three and you fire it off with like two or three armor breaks and that twenty nine thousand damage at rank two six star suddenly turns into like 45 or fifty thousand that'd be amazing that would be fun to play all right one more as we go above 150 hits that's the other thing about the special three you get like i don't know four or five hits on the counter in one 29. Okay, so it's kind of locked in at 29. So I think that's um, that's about all we need to see in this video. I don't want to make this a 10 minute long video. It's just not worth your time. But it is kind of fun to, uh, to, to try out. If there's another champion in my roster that you would like me to rank up and test in the beta before it leaves us in about a day, let me know. Any weird six star runs like this guy. Let me just remind you real quick who my champions are. In case you're like, well, Prof, I don't, know, I don't know who your roster is. All right, so we got, these are my six stars, including that duped Nightcrawler. Might be fun to take him up to rank two, maybe. Proxima, would it be fun to take Proxima for a spin at rank two with the Corvus Synergy? Maybe I'd actually have to learn how to use her properly. <laughs> That's not a joke. And then, of course, you've got um, the standard fare of uh, my five-star roster. So, yeah, love the beta. Love that I could do this. I don't know how many rank two six star Hulkbuster videos there are on YouTube, but I can promise you mine's among the best because, well, there aren't any of them out there. Thanks for watching YouTube. Have a good one.